ಚಿದಾನಂದೂಪ ಶಿವೋಹಂ ಶಿವೋ ಚಿದಾನಂದೂಪ ಶಿವೋಹಂ ಶಿವೋ ಚಿದಾನಂದೂಪ ಶಿವೋಹಂ ಶಿವೋ still your mind and still yourself ಬಾಬಾಜೀಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಯ ಯೋಗ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಆಲ್ಕೆಮಿ ಆಫ್ ಟೋಟಲ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಫರ್ಮೇಷನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ರಿಲಿಜನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಕಲ್ಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಕ್ರೀಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಯು ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಯು humanity as one's larger self the mahavatar baba ji kriya yog is an alchemy of total transformation it is a dynamic process of pran breathing through the spinal cord the spinal canal and thereby transforming the latent impressions stored in your subconscious mind into positive life energy growth when you move the breath of kriya yoga in your spinal cord behind your vertebrae there is a, a string <coughs> tenuous neuron like thing called the sushumna nadi the spinal cord within which is the sushumna nadi sushmana when you move the breath in this channel it is a process of kriya yoga what does the breath do when it moves in the spine it contacts certain astral plexus known as the pranic lotuses known as the chakras and when it passes through the chakras it nullifies your negative karma along with bodily disease mental disease of stress and tension emotional suffering is all transformed to positive life energy growth because holding your astral chakras is the dna each individual has his own set of genomes his dna in the dna dna stands for deoxy 
ribonucleic acid. So say the scientists. But that is only a shadow of the pranic chakras, which are the true source, the vortex of energy, which link the spiritual to the material. So when these chakras have generated a house, made a house for themselves called the DNA. Now the DNA has on it what is called nitrogen nubs, four nitrogen nubs. They're like tape recorders and they film, it's like a DVD, like in Europe they say Deva o Day. So it's a Deva o Day which records all your past deeds and actions. Nobody can escape from it, you know. If you're saying I'm a great dietitian and going in the night to your fridge and eating the best of chocolates, it's all recorded in the DNA, the Deva Day. And it's not only an audio cassette, it's a, the damn problem is that it's a DVD. So, <laughs> so if I sit like this and from my projector, I project my DVD, you can see on the screen my whole life story of past, present and future. Now, the Kriya breath, that's the great divine genius of Babaji. What does the Kriya breath do? The Kriya breath while moving through the spinal cord. And Gurunath, how do we make the breath move through the spinal cord? By intent. There's a saying in yogic palance, Jaha chitta vaha pran, jaha chitta vaha pran. Wherever the concentrated mind is, there the pran shall be. So as you move your pran, concentrating in the narrow pathway, the pilgrim's progress in the spinal cord, this breath, this pranic life energy rubs out the tape on the DNA. The tape recorder can be rubbed out and nullified. That's why this is a dynamic process and a very scientific process. That's why the oldest tradition in the world is the tradition of the Siddhas. They tra straddle Buddhism, they straddle Jainism, they straddle the yogis of the Garhwal Himalayas. And older than the Siddha tradition are the elite of the Siddhas who are ever immortal called the Nath yogis. Nath Siddhas, the Siddha Naths. Now this oldest of tradition wanted to expound this technique, this dynamic process of evolution, the evolution of spiritual consciousness to the West. Therefore, therefore they had to take some body, some body, put in it some soul of a yogi. They put in this body, my soul, given me this body. It's okay, I've got a broken leg and a cracked up skull not much brains, but they made a, a useful guy out of this body and uh, he has to relate and translate to them a digital tr scientific language before he goes to the devotional language. So when this breath moves in the DNA, it has a frictional action on the DNA, that is the life energy and the DNA create a friction and by this friction the karma how many of you have know or have heard of the word karma raise your hand yeah but now I'm going to tell you how the karma where it is lodged and how it can be dissolved which none of the techniques here tell you for 60 years plus I've done yoga and nothing yoga and I've been to all the systems and everywhere. And that's where the genius of Babaji lies. That this is the only technique which can dissolve your negative karma. Papun ko bhasma karke navjeevan jagrati jyot jagati hai. It burns your past evil karmas and creates a new life awakening in you. New life awakening. This is what the Kriya Yoga does very important to understand this, that it's a dynamic process of the evolution of spiritual consciousness. It is very simple. 
the more absorption, the more concentration you do it with, the more you will be absorbed. That means the more concentration you will do it, the more you will slip into meditation. Meditation cannot be done. I hear people say here, yeah, I'm going to meditate, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. You cannot meditate. I'm going to open the flower. This is a beautiful bud of a sunflower, of a, lo of a lotus or a rose. I'm going to open it. No, no. You, you have to water the plant and the flower will open itself. Otherwise, you'll break the petals. I. So you can't meditate. Nobody can meditate. Meditation happens as a result of concentration. Concentration is the practice of spiritual growth. You must know it. The word is called sadhana. Sadhana is the practice of spiritual growth.